guys and welcome back to another video and today instead of exploring I'll be mostly moving my base and so my or I know my uh, I liked my original base but I decided to have a, 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 a more of a designed better design of the base so I am currently already started moving so I do have a uh, how I'm, I'm planning to probably place put this as the demolitioner's base or like not base uh, room or slash house and basically I'm thinking of having some uh, I was I'm thinking that will be where my bed will be but I haven't fully thought about uh, rest of how the rest of the layout will be but yeah as you can see I'm kind of using the cave as the kind of the place where I'm building it obviously I made this long cliff that only I can climb. I also have that sand thingy so I can actually it's barely enough so that I can actually use my double jump to get up there so obviously my also in terms of my NPCs I'll have to think about uh, what I'll have to do in terms of that as well. Uh, let me actually use that. I don't know if it uses MP but it definitely goes to my base so that it's easier access to it. So it did take out a lot of it. I also have no, actually, I do know that I also have enough star. Oh, yeah, yeah, that you will be moving houses yeah. sooner or later. I will also have to start moving my uh, materials. Uh, but yeah, let's organize for now. Wait, where did I? I'm, I'm also kind of looking for my star. Yep, there. I knew I had enough star for Venice. Thing. So now. I have a total of 120 mana, which I never really use it up to this point, but yeah. So let me actually first start by, oh yeah, there's also the traveling merchant. I should probably talk to him before he leaves, if he can get there. Shop, Let's see, here's, okay, life form analyzer, ooh, I do have enough, uh, but let me just see can be placed. Oh, I want to see if there's anything that's useful. Other, I mean, that's also useful. Dynasty wood. Nah. Foe. Crimson cloak. Oh, uh, I actually want to get that. And since I have enough, uh, I might get that as my second thing. Let's see, what's this? Minor improvement, really sad and roller bed. Drink too much of Oh no, that's yeah, I'll just get that. I think I just... Do I equip it? Huh. Now I'm curious how other things work. But yeah, the other one I got was the Crimson Cloak. Let me just put it as aesthetically. Huh. It doesn't, it doesn't have any use to it, but I mean, it's nice. <laughs> because that's also kind of my start. Starting with my aesthetics. But yeah, I'm going to start moving all these as well. Also, what I was thinking to do today... I mean, hold on, in overall, I keep forgetting that I can't click this. So I'm going to start by moving the walls. As you saw my, is in, my, in the start of this video, that's where my thing will... Well, my actual base will be, but I, as you can remember from if you watched my last episode, which you should watch. I definitely recommend. I actually have only, I only had 34 uh, cobwebs, and I need five silk. And each co each of them costed me, uh, believe five silk, uh, five cobwebs each. And obviously, since I only have 34, I can only make. No, no, each of them costed seven. And because I only got four out of five, I couldn't make a bed. So I guess hopefully I can find so some, let me also remove all these platforms. They're not useful. They're also kind of in the way of me trying to remove the walls. Though I mean I already kind of removed all the walls here. This area. But yeah, so I'm just gonna try to remove most of the walls so I can place it on my other base. Also, another reason I'm trying to get the bed is because similar to Minecraft, the bed is used as a spawn point, and obviously since I don't have bed, my spawn point is over here. 
<laughs> in a bare land. So yeah, my main objective, either if I finish somewhat of the structure this before the end of this episode, I'm thinking of trying to find more cobwebs. One more to be exact. So that I can finally finish Uh, my bed, and I can finally take make another spawn point. Let me uh, start, start removing these wood as well because they're not used, and why not use them as a uh, material in my other base rather than this base? See, I'm starting to get rid of all the. Materials. Okay, and finally the miners and his actual place, rather than that pit, which you would have saw again in my last episode. So yeah, that's my demolition. Oh, no, I'm gonna remove these ones so that I can use it in my other race that bed again. Hopefully, there's no mobs nearby. Let's see, what else do I need to do? Uh, I'm afraid that the, these guys will leave, so I'm going to remove his because I know for sure that he is that. Uh, let's take that off out as well. Which does mean I need to make sure. So I'm now going to start moving back to my original base. So, okay, he left. Which is actually, I'll show you where it is. So that's my old base, obviously, and that's my spawn point out of my old base. And that's my new base. Well, at least where it's going to be. And it's pretty far away, but I want to use that as my base. Because it looks nice. Oh, that means there's a mod. Oh, okay, it's just the. Uh, okay, so yeah, that's my base. I'm worrying there's. Okay, there's nothing there. So. What I mean, look, look, so like I can fly there and then use my double jump just to get out there. So it's really hard to get on the top of it. But that's like the only way. So that, as you can see, uh, I also realized. Okay, let me first cover the wall with the wall that I have. And then after that, I'm going to. Let's just. Let me finish this. Put the. On the Table and chair. It's my next plan of action. Obviously, obviously. Uh, but yeah, let me get. Obviously, I also need a source of light. Uh, let's see, where did I put my table? Okay, so that's my table. I want to place it a bit far, and and that looks a bit cramped. So I'm gonna move the wall over. Oh, uh, there's an eye out at the front. I don't have to mind him. Okay, oh yeah, I also need to craft a door. I have to go downstairs to do. Uh, oh, no, not there. Uh, there we go. The door. Yeah, let's just go there. Wait, actually, I'm curious. Because technically, there is a source of light. But does that count? Wait, so it, oh no, it's just missing a wall, okay. Okay, there's also a zombie there, up there. Which he can't get to because I actually also built this roof area so that he can't fall into that. Also, I'm eventually thinking of making that into stony wall or some brick wall maybe? Because I feel like it'll be more fitting with the anvil and stuff. And also you can see I'm trying to also make a themed thing. So like obviously demolition is kind of like a miner. So he obviously will have this kind of equip like the furnace or I think that's the furnace and then the anvil. But yeah let me now check again if this is a qualifying house. Okay so so it still needs it even though technically that is a light source. Okay that's fine. I'm just going to put it on both sides because I guess it's more brighter now. Hopefully that's now qualified. Yep. And now the demolition will now live here. I do also need to start placing my other stuff. Uh, let me also start placing 
wall in this area. Oh, there's a lot of mobs outside. You guys can see like down here, quite a bit of mobs. Oh, scary. I'm worried that I might attack, it might attack me before I attack him. That's why I'm more careful, cautious. Nope, ah, oh, placed that right, wrong. I should probably save up the wall so that I can place it down in order for me to. Also, I did make stairway so that they can, if they were to get to here, they would be able to walk. Though I'm, I'm worrying if they have to walk this whole thing as well. But we'll have to worry that later. Now. Let's see, where should I put my guide into? I'm thinking I'm thinking the first floor, but where though is that? I guess that means I since I'm also kinda of going to keep this layout of the cave as my total layout of base, I'm thinking I'll just have the kind of a, his house kind of right at the wall of this place. So let me just well finish this up. And also I, I will kind of decorate so it kind of feels like there's going to be like a chimney-ish area here rather than just random wall side the furnace. So it'll be more decorative in the future. For now it's just mainly just trying to get this place set up so that there will be actual residents. Okay so that's obviously like that. Um, I think since that's the wall I'm going to just keep that. There, let me also put up the wall. I mean, not the wall, the uh, light source so I can see. And also for you guys to see as well. But yeah, so let's just finish up there. And also, I actually got a lot of these from inspiration from other uh, images of how people build. So, like, nah. It's not too difficult, you just have to place down the platform, wood, wood platforms, and use the hammer to kind of make them into stairs, for instance. But yeah, it's... Oh wait, I just realized I... Two, three. Oh no, that's... Wait, so this is three, so that's where the door is. So that's one, two, three, so this is the roof. Oh yeah, it is, it will match that. Obviously I haven't dug out everything. Obviously there will be another, probably, either a room or, I do also need a chest room, so I might use that as my chest room. You'll have to see in my future episodes to see what I might build more. What more I'll build. I can't, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Also, I have no idea what to put in my guy's room. So if you guys have any suggestions on what I could put in his room. Please write them down in the comments, and I'll be gladly adding those kind of items down. But yeah, let's start by just... If, oh wait, I forgot, you can't... Oh wait, wait, how do I remove these? Oh, clear. Wait for, oh right, I forgot. For some reason, you have to get all of it across. I don't know why, I don't know why they... If it's intentional or something, but... For some reason, you have to basically destroy the walls before around the start of the area. So that I can actually get to the back. So like, I have to basically dig up this whole area just so I can get to the back. Which is really, I don't know if it's a bug or if it's something that they wanted to do, but it's really annoying. So like, I basically have to destroy all of this just to get to the back. And I can't even replace it with the other wall because it's the same thing. You have to start from somewhere where you actually had a wall to place a wall. So like now I can now now I can do it, but before it was really annoying where I least kept to remove the walls. Oh, and I just realized I used up all my walls. Oh, let me also oh wait. Am I out of wood as well? Well, I need to harvest more wood as so. well. Oh no! Oh yeah, I also have that thing. So there's no rare creature feedback. Well, let me wait. I might as well just make more space for the 
other villager, other residents to live. So he has actual space. Oops. Uh, I'm going. Oh uh, yes. So let's. I'm thinking kind of decorating the front. These. So obviously this here. Oh, I also. Ha I'm thinking. Oh wait, I don't. Uh, actually, I'm going to take out some. Of, I'm going to take ev uh, alternating wood so I don't fall down. Like so, and then what I'm because the reason I'm doing that is so I can. Oh, I wasn't planning to open the door. <laughs> but it seems I need. I prob I'll do that in a bit. It comes back. But yeah, the reason I'm doing this is so I can place more down here. And my end goal is to. I'm. I'm oh, wait, there's obviously a mob there, but he can't come in because it's all blocked. But yeah. Back to where it was just that moment ago. So yeah, I'm trying to put that there so that I can put banners up here, kind of as an entrance decoration. Those are from the pyramid that I've got from my last episode. So again, there's a lot of things that you, if you didn't see, you might as well catch up from my last episode. I'll probably put the link down in the description. And also, yeah. I don't know what I was going to say there, but yeah. just trying to decorate around here, let's see, until, uh, I can technically use my mirror to go back, but I want to try to at least put down most of the stuff there. I feel like there is going to be something related to these things. For now, I'll, I'll place them randomly, like outside, so that I can use them, and I don't have to carry extra weight on myself. Obviously, oh yeah, why, why do I have clay pot? Uh, oh, I think it might have been from my thing up here, I, because I did place a coin pot on this thing. But yeah, it's, oh, I, I have so much materials, but I don't need most of them. I'll have to, let, let me put these down here. Oh, I also need to, oh yeah, I'm gonna, I have an idea about the tea. Oh yeah, wow, there's a lot of, oh no, I did not realize. There we go. Uh, what I'm okay, I I want to put down some tiki torch down here. Let me actually mind this. I'm off track right now because I want to. I want to just fit, remove all these ones from here. Uh, and then I'm gonna use my dirt block to kind of fill it up. Make it look clean. See it. Mm. Uh, oh, wait, actually, wait. Uh, let's use my magic mirror. So there we are. Back at home, old home. Let's also get rid of that. I think I this one is also no house there. I might as well just. Uh, I'm scared if I remove the house, they'll leave the house, like leave totally. So I'm trying to be careful with that. At the same time, like, uh, taking my time, obviously, it just doesn't even make sense. But yeah, let me move this there. Uh, I do have extra chairs. Uh, let's see what. Oh, yeah, I was that the reason I was doing that was so I can. Wait, wait, do I. Oh, I didn't take out everything. That was my mistake. There we go. And let us. What is he? He likes it here, but uh, you're moving, so. Also, I'm moving these platforms because that's not useful for me anymore since there's no longer a house here. I also might as well take more of uh, these woods, wood walls, so that I can use that in my other build. Again. And I think I'm going to actually fast forward this area because it's going to get boring.
I'm back. So that took uh, quite a while to get rid of most of those, but I mean, I'll, I'll be back to where they are. So actually, I'm gonna also might as well take these doors as well. Yeah. So now let's travel all the way back to my base, and I might actually also fast forward this area as well. And we're back yet again. And finally we're back to my old base. I mean my new base, not my old base. So yeah, so let's start. Actually I also realized uh, do I have any wood? I do have 15 wood. Ah, oh, I accidentally went up there. I do also wanna no, I don't wanna make it small. I'll just try to mine away most of this so that we can at least make more space in this area. I don't know if he mines dirt block as his temporary material of his house. Because I don't have it. Oh, I have a full stack of. Oh, yeah, let's, let's ignore that. Let's put down. Is it. That. I do have a door there. I also do need to place uh, all of that into wood wall. At least parts that need to be filled in. So. Again, all these walls are temporary until I have better source of wall materials. But until then, uh. So, might as well actually, might as well. Use up, up. Oh, I hear duck sounds. I don't know. Okay, so that hopefully is it is suitable. So that will be his room. I'm thinking I'll yeah I'll probably have that as. I'm, I'll have to think about what I want to actually have that as. But until then. Hmm, but I also need another room. And that- wait, what's the other guy's name? He's the merchant. He's kind of like a selling guy, so he's- uh, That means I need to think where- He also needs to be kind of in the front. Because I feel like it kind of makes sense for a merchant to have its own front yard. Kind of- kind of- Or like have kind of area where you can put this- so-called stall. I don't know, I, I'm trying to design it based off something, but that means, I mean, also it'll make sense for him to have, yeah, so what I'm going to do then, I'm thinking how, I, mean, I originally was planning this to be my room, but I could expand whole area here and make the, that my room, but see, I'm probably going to have this as his room. I also probably should have some sizes. So, uh, um, actually I might end off my video here. It's getting quite long, lengthy. But yeah, so this will be my next room. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and write in the comments what I could do, what I could possibly do more next time. Also write down also in the comments what I could add to this build to make it more look nicer and more blended into this environment. But yeah. Again, don't forget to like and si subscribe to this channel if you haven't. And see you guys in the next video. Bye!